y'all. Welcome back. Artisan Power here. Today we are back at the local Makerspace Steam Junction beside their shop by tools. And I'm glad I'm sitting beside this tool because a couple weeks ago I had the privilege to take a factory tour of the world headquarters of Shopbot Tools in Durham, North Carolina, which is right up the road from Burlington, North Carolina, about maybe an hour's drive, give or take a few minutes. But I got to take a full factory tour. I got to meet the founder of Shopbot Tools, Ted Hall. Awesome gentleman to sit there and talk to for a while and kind of pick his brain with what the company's all about. So that was a real cool experience. I shot some video up there and I'm about to show y'all that video. Um, but before we get to that, if this is your first time on my channel, please continue to like and share my videos. And if you haven't, I encourage you to click that subscribe button for more. Um, and now let me show you guys some of the clips that I shot at ShopBot World Headquarters in Durham. Here we are arriving at the world headquarters of ShopBot in Durham, North Carolina, where we were immediately greeted by friendly staff, and the tour began soon after. Here is a showroom showing all the capabilities of the ShopBot tool, and I had no clue going into this factory tour the capabilities of the ShopBot but there is a boat hanging from the ceiling that was made on the shop bot and they, as you can see they have several sponsors just stuff hanging everywhere that shows off the versatility and the awesomeness of the shop bot tool here is more work hanging on the wall um, this 3D relief cut of this old train was beautiful. Just awesome work in the Last Supper there. I thought that was awesome. And we are about to head into the main factory area where the shop bots are made. We have something very interesting, a new take on dovetail type joinery. Here we are in the main factory work area of ShopBot tools. Um, there was a guy packaging and getting a ShopBot ready to send out to a new customer. It was a very friendly work environment. All the employees loved working for ShopBot. Several shop bots there, already packed up and ready to go. Here we have another view of the factory floor. Um, with employees just scattered throughout doing their jobs. Here was a guy working at his station, assembling some of the um, smaller parts on the shop bots. Again, I was just surprised that this was so close to Burlington. I had no clue that ShopBot World Headquarters was just up the road in Durham, North Carolina. Here is something I thought was cool. They were using ShopBot tools to make shop bots. I thought that was real cool. Cutting out parts for a shop bot. And they had quite a few of these shop bots set up throughout the factory. Cutting out shop bot parts. Here is another one um, working. And yet another one working. Cutting out parts for future shop bots. Here was the main reason for our visit. Um, ShopBot was letting the Makerspace use one of their new HandyBot ShopBots 
on a one-year loan so the main reason for the visit was to pick this tool up and this room here was where they are assembled I hope you guys like this video and I hope you guys continue to stick around and stay tuned for more videos take care and I'll see y'all real soon